Hi, I'm Marty Nemco. This word with Marty is CZ, or cubic zirconium. Why would somebody spend a thousand times as much on a diamond as on a cubic zirconium? When cubic zirconium is actually, unless except for top one thousandth of one percent of diamonds, are sparklier, are more, more perfect. Emotion. Nobody wants to feel, it's a way of showing you're cared about. If somebody spends a lot of money on you, on the diamond, it suggests they care about you more than if you, they bought you a CZ. And of course, this is merely one example of the many instances in which we spend wildly more for emotion, for perception. The quartz movement in a $10 Casio is, this keeps exactly the same amount of time, the same amount of accuracy as a Patek Philippe or as a Rolex. And actually, some of those expensive ones seem to require more maintenance, whereas the Casios don't, or you just throw them out after two years or you change the battery. Why would somebody buy a Mercedes or a Jaguar or a Land Rover or whatever, rather than a Toyota, which break down more? There's nothing prestigious about getting towed, standing on the side of the road waiting for the tow truck and then having your car sit in service. Or even if it doesn't break down, those fancy cars require, like Porsches and Mercedes and the rest, require far more maintenance and service than a Toyota. This emotional thing about prestige, about brand. They spend billions, the companies spend billions of dollars to build the perception. Gorgeous babes draped over a car or wearing that Cartier watch or De Beers diamonds, they show a diamond is forever. All about emotion. So that's why I chose the word CZ, cubic zirconium, as emblematic of our tendency to put aside rationality in favor of the emotion of brand, being perceived as better. Really discerning, intelligent people tend to look down upon somebody who wears a coach purse that costs 300 or 500, let alone a Land Van or other top Chanel purse for 7,000. We say, boy, this person is shallow. They're spending all this on, the, on veneer. Even though the product is worse, they must be shallow or stupid or whatever. So I raise, I come up with this word with Marty, CZ, as a way of perhaps nudging you to think about, are you paying too much for this ineffable thing called status, brand, prestige, feeling loved? Yeah, and actually in romance, that's pretty important. When I, I was a, a pianist when I was a teenager, made a lot of money. I never told anybody I was making a lot of money. My dates, I actually took them out cheaply. We would go out for ice cream or pizza, or, but never fancy dinners, uh, never fancy gifts, because I wanted to be loved for me, not my wallet. So, you know, if, if the person you're dating seems to want to go to a place that serves $20 drinks and would love expensive gifts, ask yourself whether that person really loves you or loves your wallet. In any event, that word with Marty is CZ. As usual, I do thank you for watching, and I do welcome your thumbs up and accept your thumbs down. I always look forward to your comments, and especially like it if you hit the share button below. Share on your social media so that my efforts can have broader impact. And I am flattered if you choose to subscribe to my channel. And certainly would welcome you taking a look at any of my 32 books. The most relevant would be How to Do Life, but all 32 are on Amazon. You can just go there and search on my name, Marty Nemco, N-E-M-K-O, and you will find more than you can stomach. In any event, I do thank you for watching. I am Marty Nemco.